Hi everyone, my name is Kate and I'm really excited to share this book, We Are Water Protectors, with you today. This is the first book written by an Indigenous per person or illustrated by an Indigenous person to win the Caldecott Medal. And it's a book about Indigenous women standing up to protect water on their land. I hope that you enjoy it and I also hope that it helps you think about the different parts of nature that are important to you and that you rely on and that you might stand up to help protect. Let's take a look at the book. Water is the first medicine, Nokomis told me. We come from water. It nourished us inside our mother's body as it nourishes us here on Mother Earth. Water is sacred, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. The river's rhythm runs through my veins, runs through my people's veins. My people talk of a black snake that will destroy the land. Spoil the water, poison plants and animals, wreck everything in its path. When my people first spoke of the black snake, they foretold that it wouldn't come for many, many years. Now the black snake is here. Its venom burns the land, courses through the water, making it unfit to drink. Take courage. I must keep the black snake away from my village's water. I must rally my people together. To stand for the water, to stand for the land, to stand as one against the black snake. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. It will not be easy. We fight for those who cannot fight for themselves. The winged ones, the crawling ones, the four-legged, the two-legged, the plants, trees, rivers, and lakes. earth. We are all related. Tears like waterfalls stream down, tracks down my face, tracks down my people's faces. Water has its own spirit, Nokomis told me. Water is alive. Water remembers our ancestors who came before us, she said. We stand with our songs and our drums. We are still here. We are stewards of the earth. Our spirits have not been broken. We are water protectors. We stand. The black snake is in for the fight of its life.